Happy New Year, everybody! Have a great time tonight. So, how many people are playing? Got it. All by yourself, huh? Great. Less work for me. Why don't you type in your name? Twenty-five seconds. All right. Pick your icon. Just hit it. Thirty seconds. Okay. Your buzzer is gonna be the letter B. Okay, everybody, you ready? It's head rush time. Hey there! How's it going? My name's Bob, and if you have any questions at all, hey, please feel free to keep them to yourself. Anyway, so here's the scoop it. On your marks, get set, uh, yes. Okay, I need a category. May I introduce game show hosts who wear tights. 10,000 beanies if you get this one. Heads up, here it comes. If the feuding families in Shakespeare's room, do it! Survey says... Romeo was a Montague and Juliet was a Capulet. And I think they actually met on Singled Out. Category, please. The category? That's kinda purdy. Get it right, I'm handing over 20K. Hey, check it out, I got one of those magic eye picture books for my birthday, it's so great, man. It's got all these scribbly paintings, you know, and if you stare at them long enough, a 3D image pops right off the page. Here, watch, let me relax my eyes a little bit, pull the book back slower. Yes, I think I got it. What three-dimensional magic eye image am I looking at right now? Coyotes howling at the moon, dolphins jumping through the air, Waldo peeking out from behind a tree or nothing. I have a headache. I'm sorry, I've been staring at this freaking page the whole time and I can't see a damn thing. All I know is I'm getting a headache and my eyes are tearing up and I... Oh, wait a minute, there it is! It's the unicorn. Oh, well, that's kind of cool. I need a category. And this is... Remember the rental car. Looks like this one's going for 10,000 bucks. A one, a two, a three. If Alamo Rent-A-Car used someone who actually fought at the Alamo as their spokesperson, what might you see in their commercials? Pecos Bill lassoing you a great deal. Davy Crockett shooting at low, low prices. George Washington chopping down high costs. Or Paul Bunyan plowing under hidden fees. Davy Crockett fought and died at the Alamo. Which is why you should always wear your seatbelt. Wait a minute. All righty, pick one. For your enjoyment, you can use your fingers for this one. And you pocket 20,000 clams if you get this one. Think fast. Which of these equals three? Original members of Boys to Men, Killers and Scream, Arnold Kids on the Wonder Years, or Original Power Rangers? There's Karen, Wayne, and Kevin. Three kids, just like every TV family has. No, seriously, think about it. The Simpsons, Home Improvement, Major Dad, Boy Meets World, Dinosaurs, Roseanne, Full House, the list goes on. I mean, try to think of a major TV family that doesn't have three kids. You can't. Okay, pick a category. H-E-A-D-B-U-T-T, headbutt. H-E-A-D-B-U-T-T, H-E-A-D-B-U-T-T, headbutt. One headbutt category coming up, when cute is disturbing. I'd say $50,000 sounds like a good place to start this headbutt question. Here's how you headbutt. A question like this will fly out. Oh, fabulous. Can we go now? Talk to me. Type in your answer and hit return. You know, I used to think Hello Kitty was just for girls, but I gotta tell you, those Hello Kitty PJs are really comfortable. Honestly. 
category, please. Looks like this category is philosophical meat-like substances. And you're playing for a $30,000 wad. Flex those fingers, because here it comes. If the makers of Spam use the famous words of philosopher René Descartes to promote their product, what will be printed on the Spam label? I think, therefore I Spam. Wham Bam, thank you Spam. To Spam or not to Spam. Or, I am what I Spam. To convince himself that he actually existed, René Descartes came up with the phrase, I think, therefore I am. So, I guess he thinks he's chopped pork shoulder meat. Mm-hmm. I'm hungry. I need a category. This category is known as the Melrose Zoo. This one can get you 10 grand. Wow, that Amanda from Melrose Place is one cold chick. If they replace cold-blooded Amanda with a cold-blooded animal, which of the following scenes will you most likely see? A crocodile sleeping with Billy, a hippopotamus sleeping with Jake, a duck sleeping with Peter, or an armadillo sleeping with Michael? Crocodiles are cold-blooded animals, which means their body temperature changes with the outside temperature. Oh, Amanda, babe, I love you so much. Cut! All righty, pick one. Hey, nice choice. You just picked a dis or dat. The category for this dis or dat question is, mmm, tastes like gangsta. Chew on this. I'm going to show you a bunch of names, and I want you to tell me if they're rappers, the names of a food mascot, or both. Okay, fine. You know the rules. Here comes the monkey timer. Let's boogie. Frankenberry, rapper, food mascot, or both? Salt and Peppa. Poppin' Fresh. Snap. Cornelius. Vanilla Ice. One more, Red Baron. That's all she wrote. Hey, only one wrong. Pretty good, Tiger. Let's check out your total. Satisfied? Great. Let's move on. It came. And I believe this one's called Mmm, Stop Kissing Me. And it's worth 20,000 bucks if you get this one right. Oh my god, it's a Hanson question. No! If teen songbirds Hanson were to make a special appearance in the city of brotherly love, what might their fans see? Zach smooching Taylor in San Francisco, Isaac kissing Taylor in Tulsa, Isaac giving Zach a peck in London, or Taylor Frenching Isaac in Philadelphia? The city of brotherly love is Philadelphia. I always knew there was something weird going on in that family. Okay, I need a... Say hello to homework you can do in front of the TV. 20,000 bucks for a correct answer. Hey, check this out. I was going through some old reports I turned in for my science class, and I found this one I wrote for an experiment I had to do. Sat on couch watching TV many hours without moving. Resisted all motion until mother forced me to take out garbage. What scientific principle did I demonstrate in this lab report? Inertia, evaporation, infraction, or evolution? Inertia is the scientific law that states an object remains at rest or in motion until it's acted upon by another force. In this case, the force was my mom. You know, I also did an experiment demonstrating the concept of gravity by spilling the garbage all over my mom's new carpeting. All righty, pick one. For the head rush. Uh oh, you think you know the head rush, huh? Well, I got news for you. Not all rushes are equal. Here's your clue. What high school do you guys go to? Well, you better do well at this high school or I'm sending your butt to detention. Good luck.
Hey, Green, you were like the best player we had this whole game. Really, I mean that. Thank you for playing Head Rush, and uh, hey, I'll see you next time. And that's a wrap. Another day, another peso. Diva Bambina, tell me, is it going to be Uno Mas game? It was a hard fight, but you made it to the high scoreboard. And now the reward, a free game. Of course, at this point, they're all free games. But it just sounded nice to say. Play again? Let me know.